It's Halloween! Halloween! I'm dressed as a vampire. Do you know what you are going to be, Morpho? Morpho! Ghost! I can almost see through you. <laughs> but aren't you afraid of ghosts? Yeah. Morpho's afraid of ghosts? <laughs> Let's show our costumes to the other magic pets. Yeah! Apple! Atmo, stop! It's just Morphle. Uh, is everything okay? <laughs> it's a ghost! Come back! It's just Morphle! Ghosts aren't real! Worry, Morphle. We'll find them and explain that you're not a real ghost. Yeah. Boom. Ah! Ghosts aren't even real. <laughs> Leave Morphle alone, Mr. Vanderboos. Afraid of ghosts. <laughs> The city is haunted! Haunted? Yes! Listen! Don't follow us! Don't come here! Me, my voice? That wasn't me. <laughs> Even the trees are haunted! Don't come here! That's not a real ghost. No real? Nope. I'll show you. Don't come here. Don't follow us. Don't come here, scary ghost. Magic patch! Yeah! Hello, magic pets. What are you doing? We are trying to keep the ghost away. <laughs> that isn't a real ghost. It's Morphle. Oh, you scared us, Morphle. But you three scared the whole city with your powers. You were just like a real ghost. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Morphle? Ooh. Ghosts aren't real. I am a real ghost. What is happening? <laughs> and this is Cootie. Oh, what a cutie! And when he's happy, <laughs> monster! No, no, wait! Aw, oh, shucks. What's wrong, Daddy? Well, the one thing that Cootie loves the most is to scare people. But when he does, people run away and don't want to be his friend. But tonight is Halloween night. People will like it when you scare them. Yes, Cootie. Maybe you should go with Mila and Morphle to trick or treat. Yes, 
We're going to have lots of fun. Hi, Mr. Vanderboos. <laughs> Are those your Halloween costumes? <laughs> They're not even scary. Cootie, but I don't think Mr. Vanderboos likes Halloween anyway. Let's keep going. Oh, look at you! So scary. Hmm, what are you supposed to be? What a wonderful costume! I haven't been scared like that in years. Yay! Thank you very much! Mommy, they stole my costume! What? Who did? We did! We are now the Halloween Costume Bandits! <laughs> and this little guy's costume is by far the scariest! We want it! Stein, it won't come off. Nah, we need to go, Yon. Morphle, morph into a spider. No, please, uh, don't hurt us. saved everybody's costumes. I'm sorry I called you a monster earlier. Do you want to be my companion? Do you want to come trick or treat with us, Phoebe? I'm sorry, guys, but my mom never lets me trick or treat. Come on, dear. Well, too bad. Let's go, Morphle. I'm sorry, Phoebe, but you're a witch. And you know what happens to witches when the sun sets on Halloween. All witches become evil. Yeah, right. Who even believes that old story? Bye-bye, and thank you. Wow, look at all this candy. Too bad Phoebe couldn't come with us. Wow, Morphle, that was a really great costume, don't you think? <laughs> Morphle, I'm more scary. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> huh? <laughs> costume? No, those can't be costumes. to find out what's going on, Morphle. Morph into a giant spider and follow the candy.
Other children? <laughs> Did you collect more candy than you could eat yourselves last night? Um, sort of. Well, I think it's very nice that you want to share it with the rest of the children. Thank you, Mila. Mila, Morphle, you have to bring this egg to Uncle Mortimer before it hatches. It has his new magic bed inside it. Quick, Morphle, morph into a car. Good luck! A trap! Big jam! <gasps> Morphle, dodge the cars! Now dodge that traffic light! Oh no! The egg is starting to hatch! We have to be faster! Morphle, morph into a race car! What? 
the city. Stop them when Morphle doesn't do what you say. <sighs> okay, here we go, Bandit Yawn. I'm sure it will work, Stein. Mom! There are two people here that want to tell you something. <sighs> if it isn't my good for nothing, sons, I don't have time for the two of you right now. The president isn't going to blackmail himself. Tell her, tell her. Your sons are the greatest baddies that I have ever seen in my city. They are truly bad baddies. What are you talking about? My sons have never been real baddies, and now they've even brought a cop to my house. Why, I, you two are even worse baddies than I thought. But... Mom, <laughs> tell us that we are great baddies. Yes, tell us you are proud of us. Stop it, bandits. Why should we? You are just a little girl without your red blob. Everybody, grab them. Huh? Why are these people following your orders? Did you hypnotize them? People shouldn't do what you say because you force them. They should do what you say because they agree with you. And for wrecking the city, you two are going to jail. My sons are getting arrested? Yes, Mom. We get arrested all the time. Oh. Boys, the two of you are real baddies after all. <laughs> I'm so proud of 
from you guys. Did you hear that, Stein? Yes, I did, Jorn. Yes, I did. The city looks perfect again, but come on, guys. It's time for bed now. No, Daddy. We don't want to go to bed. And you should only do what people say if you agree with them. <laughs> That's true. But little kids do what their daddies say. <laughs> Just daddies? And mommies. And school teachers. And the police officer. And grandmas and grandpas. Uh, let's see, and... <laughs> this is going to be fun! I will stay here in the Middle Ages as Princess Leela. And I will go to the future and be Mila. And of course, I shall get Morphle. Well, Leela, he can't stay with you. I'm his human companion. And I promise to always take care of him. Oh, But I do have another idea. Really? Oh, joy, oh, joy! Ta-da! Oh, okay. Not quite what I was expecting. But one mustn't complain. Well, come on. No time to waste. Into the time racer. Oh, uh, um, uh, okay. Yeah, bye. Goodbye. Mila, Morpho, I need your help. <laughs> we are now the police car bandits. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know if... But I need your help. Okay. Come on, Morpho. Look, Stein, we are actually getting away with it this time. <laughs> Great job, Mila and Morphle. We are heroes, Millicent. Oh, no. There's a traffic jam. <laughs> Morphle, please help the kids get to the zoo. Morphle, morph into a bus. Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Bye! Oh, no. Morphle, the garbage truck broke. Okay, move into a garbage truck. Millicent. <gasps> How filthy! Did you see that, Millicent? This is too much. We shall return to our own time at once. Yes. It turns out that being you is not as easy as I thought it was. 
What are you two up to today? We're playing with Morphle's favorite toy, <gasps> Mr. Action! Mr. Action is really great and always helps people in need. Except for the bad guys, of course, like Professor Evil. Oh, wow! How about we zap him to life so he can really help the people in the city? Mr. Action, will you? Oh, <laughs> put it on the ground, Morphle. Whoa. I am Mr. Action! <laughs> Professor Evil, my enemy. Hand over that device. Oh, mm. all right. Well, that was easy. Oh, no! Time to help the city fall! Mr. Action! We have to get that life ray back, Morpho! Quickly, morph into a superhero, too! This calls for action. Don't worry, ma'am. I've got this. Get out of here! Catch it, Morphle! Leave this woman alone! Thank you, Morphle. <laughs> and you're the worst! Take that, boys. That definitely calls for some action. Wait, what? Here you go, honest citizens. Uh, but those are the bad guys. Lying never pays, Peter Freeze. <laughs> Holding Professor Evil. Are you his henchman? No, no, no. This is 
Professor Evil? Professor Evil is a toy, just like you used to be, Mr. Action. This is Professor Rashid, and he shouldn't be a toy. Oh, no. Thank you for your explanation, tiny blueberry girl. <laughs> Tumbling test tubes. Oh. But how can I fight Professor Evil now? I must become a toy again myself! <laughs> no one can stop me now! Mr. Action! Oh no! What's the hold-up? You've caught us already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> look at him. <laughs> look, look. <laughs> must be so great! I wish I was a princess! Really? <laughs> I wish I lived in your time! Leela? Leela? Oh. <laughs> this is gonna be fun! Bye, Mila! I think you will make a great princess. I hope so. Come on, Morphle. Bandits? We are sheriffs! Yes, Princess Leela. And your father left us in charge while he is on his travels. So we can take all the money we want. <laughs> well, I'm the princess now, so I have to help my people. Morphle, morph into Sir Father's suit of armor. Princess Leela! Hello, Sheriffs. I have returned from my travels. Me, Sir Father. Yeah, sure. <laughs> you can't trick us twice. Give me that beard. Huh? How? Uh, Stein, it's not coming off. Pull harder. Mm. Oh. You two have committed the greatest of crimes in all the land. 
pulling on the king's beard, I shall have you thrown into the dungeon. A princess was such hard work. I wonder how Leela is doing in our time. But Stein, now that we have run away from the king, we can never be sheriffs again. Hmm. Yes, Yorn. We are no longer the sheriffs. From now on, we will be the bandits. Ah, <laughs> yeah. And our children, and our children's children, and our children's children's children. Ah, <laughs> yeah. And our children's children's children. <laughs> 